This is limits in 60 seconds. Say we have the function f of x equals x squared minus 4 over x minus 2. If we try to find f of 2, we get, well, 0 over 0. And that's undefined. But we can somewhat get around this by asking the question, what does f of x approach as we get closer to x equals 2? This is what a limit is. We try to find the limit as x approaches 2 of f of x. We can solve this by factoring at the numerator, cancelling like terms, and getting limit as x approaches 2 of x plus 2. Now we can plug in 2 for x, and we get 2 plus 2, aka 4. So f of x approaches 4. We can see this on a graph as well. If we graph y equals f of x, we see a line with a hole at x equals 2. And if we try approaching x equals 2 from both sides, we see that it is 4. It approaches 4, so the limit is 4. And the cool thing about limits is, they can exist even if a function is undefined at a certain point.